Hello, my name is Pixelated. Oh my goodness. Oh my goodness, let me get out of the, out of here because I tell you what, I cannot build in peace and quiet on this planet. And I'm not complaining, not at all, because I really like my new spot here on Saphonix, 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 Captain America. And I really like it. And I think that I needed that fresh start to get the ball rolling again here in Boundless. And I know from the, the last video, people saw me reclaiming my my build and they saw the title and they thought that i was leaving the game that's how i know you didn't watch the video that's how i know i i can see you i'm judging you you did not watch the video <laughs> i am not leaving the game i was just reclaiming the area because i think that it was time for me to have a fresh start because i kind of felt like i had so many overwhelmingly large unfinished projects and uh, things that I wanted to tear down and restart and I just didn't have the room to do it and I all the miscalculations I made you know building it kind of messed up my other ideas so rather than like you know starting over or tearing things down I just decided that it was time for me to start fresh and it just gave me a new like renewed feeling in the game if that makes any sense I know sometimes you get bored in a game and sometimes it just need, it takes a kick in the butt of starting fresh somewhere else. You know, if it's World of Warcraft, because I've definitely done that. I've gone from Alliance to Horde to Horde to Alliance and back and forth and so on and so forth. Deleted characters, made new characters, all that stuff to um, kind of refresh the game for me. So here we are doing the same in Boundless. Um, so this is a whip, you guys. This is completely a whip. Not a whole lot done down here. Um, I've been back and forth. There's, there's a lot of unfinished stuff, but I promise you and I promise myself that I'm not going to leave a slew of unfinished projects in my wake. I'm going to try to get everything done before I move on to something else. So I will be in this hole for a while before I start building above ground. All right. So while I've been building um, and, you know, I just kind of had an epiphany today um, or this morning when I, you know, was doing a little building before um, I went to church. Yes, I do go to church. Okay. Um, so I decided that I was going to um, start a new series. And I feel like as boundless players, as citizens, as civilians, as Ortians, that we spend a lot of time in our workshops, in our storage homes, storage houses, storage building, storage units, storage areas. Um, and they're like our second homes. So I thought that I would love to see what you got going on because I've been running around looking for inspiration because um, I'm, I, the first time I built my workshop, I didn't really know how to set up the machines. I just kind of winged it and went from there and I didn't really like it. So um, after a while, just kind of like, okay, yeah, I need something new. I need to tear this down and because I don't like it I want to reconfigure it so I've been running around trying to look at how other people have theirs configured and um I fell in love with so many um examples as I've been traveling especially doing hidden gem videos so I decided that I wanted to do another series called storage wars not storage wars workshop wars but um it could be storage if you don't have a workshop because some people don't have workshops some people use their guild workshop and that's fine too. If you have a guild workshop, let me know. I want to see what you got going on. So what do you mean? What do I mean? Well, let's step into my office. Okay, this isn't my office. This, this is actually HSE. It's not my office. I wish it was my office, but it's not. It's not. I'm sure they would not appreciate me <laughs> setting up my office in the middle of their build. I'm pretty sure they would not. Um, no. So I, I want to show you. Okay, where? Um, I mean, okay, here it is. Here it is. I want to show you their guild workshop because it is the most awe inspiring workshop I've ever seen, honestly. Um, guild workshop, because your, your personal workshop may look better than this. If it does, 
listen, I, I will say that there are some gorgeous, gorgeous player workshops that I've come across. Um, two off the top of my head, Pericosis and George George. If you have not seen either one of those um, workshops, what are you doing with your boundless life? You need to stop by. So, yes. Um, this is magnificent. Like who and why and how, I don't know. And I have come back to admire multiple times just because I know that my brain doesn't work this way. And I am like in love with that person's brain that did this because wow, they are super, super creative and I love it. Like, do you plan this out or does this just come to you? Um, I have spent many a night thinking about my boundless spells. How bad is that? What is this? What is this? Pigment processor. That's what it looks like? Oh, I never knew. It, it's in different colors. I had no clue. I've never seen a pigment processor before. So that's cool. Anyway, so this place is so huge. It is huge. There's so many machines. Like, wow. Like, how, how many people are in your guild that you guys need this? Probably the amount of projects they do, like build projects, they probably do need all these machines. And honestly, with this massive uh, workshop, who who needs a workshop? I would just come down here and work. Absolutely. What? And the okay, this is a part that I've never been down. I don't get past that hallway. Uh, oh my gosh. What? And the wow, they are so organized. There's so many. Okay, so they have a workshop slash storage unit. This is a massive storage area. Like, what? It's like HSC is preparing for the apocalypse or something. What? It, it just keeps going. I can't even. So, you see what I'm saying? This is what I'm talking about. I want to see what you got going on. And if you don't mind me coming by and recording and you don't take an issue with that let me know in the comments or catch me on the forums because i'll post this on the forum as well where you're located and i, I mean it's planets um your coordinates coordinates you got to coordinate uh-huh most people don't coordinate so you got to oh, coordinate yes, that's what you did yeah. uh your um if you have a workshop name your name your end game name you know so i give you a shout out so people can you know speak to you when you you walk by um and listen i'm a peon channel so don't think that you'll become internet famous you i'll make you famous you won't, <laughs> um, but you will get a, a proper shout out from um, me, I guess, <laughs> if you care. Uh, but I definitely wanted to come by and see what you got going on. Um, check out your spot and uh, yeah. So that is actually all that I have for you guys today. Um, I'm coming um, at you from a very like weird time in my boundless um gameplay because I have no absolute workshop and I just felt like wow you know workshops are truly truly important because I'm literally living out of boxes and in a hole and wow that was loud and I've got like a few a couple machines actually set up outside so I can do a little bit of work at least kind of feel my portals um, so that's about it so workshops are definitely important and so um, I wanted to be able to feature that and not only just show the boundless community but maybe some other people that watch my channel that don't play boundless because um, of course I like this game and I think that it does not get the attention that it deserves so that's always kind of been my uh, main goal for boundless and doing these videos for boundless because i want people to see how um awesome this game can be um you know for anyone that loves to build or explore um and kill stuff all right <laughs> that is all i have for you guys today um i do i hope to hear from you and let me know uh if it's cool if i come and stop by oh you have to let me do a solo dolo. Like, no one's got to be there. I want to become one with your workshop. <laughs> All right, guys. Until next time, I have been Pixelated Twix. Ciao.